Hi, this is Mike Leahy at BookUp. Let me show you how you can use Master Chess with different chess engines. First I'll go to the Commands menu and I'll choose Change Engine Settings. Here's a drop-down menu that shows you all the chess engines that are installed. And by default Stockfish 1.8 is the installed engine and probably the strongest. Ruffian is the engine used with uh, Master Chess uh, 4000, 5000, 6000, and well up until 7000 when we switch to Stockfish 1.8. Robolito is also another engine, so let me check that one, and it shows where it's installed, and what EXE is running, and what startup commands are being sent to the engine, and I just click OK. Now when I get the chess engine window up, it's showing Robolito analysis, and I can uh, make this window smaller if I don't want to look at all that detail. Maybe I just want to look at the best line, move that around. I'll open it back up so I can see what happens when I choose a different engine. So like the commands menu change engine settings again and this time go to Ruffian and click OK. Within about a second Ruffian starts to do analysis. Now let's take a look at what it takes to install a new chess engine. I just heard that the Stockfish 1.9 engine was just released so let's go look for that. Uh, their site is www.stockfishchess.com I'm going to click here to download Stockfish 1.91 for Windows. Now, Firefox asks me where do I want to save this file. And what I'll do is I'll save this file, Stockfish 191 win.zip. I will save it in, let's see, Drive C in Program Files, where Master Chess is installed. And let's see if I can find Master Chess on here. It should be Chess Chess DVDs, Master Chess 7000. And here is an engines folder. I'll open that. And you can see I have folders here for Robolito, Ruffian, and Stockfish. What I want to do now is make a new folder for Stockfish 1.9. So I'll click on the Create New Folder button. Stockfish 1.9. And I'll double click on that one. Inside of here, I'll save the Stockfish 191 WinZip file. Firefox has downloaded the file into that folder. Now what I'll do is I'll right-click and say, open the containing folder. Again, this will be a little different in Internet Explorer, but in Firefox, this is how it's done. Now that I've opened the containing folder, I can see that the Stockfish 191 WinZip file is here. And my version of Windows uh, zip files open automatically, so I can just double-click on this. Once it's been unzipped, I've got a new folder called Stockfish 191 Win, and that's the one that actually has the EXEs for the chess engine in it. I'll double click that to open it up. I double click that, that folder, and I get the Windows folder. Now I double click on the Windows folder. Now, finally, I've gotten to the chess engines. And if I have a 32 bit version of Windows, I'll use that one. Almost everybody will be using this one, and it runs fine on every computer anyway. If you do happen to have a 64 bit version of Windows and want to try this 64 one, go ahead. But I'll select this one, select uh, right click, and then select copy. Now that the engine's been copied, I can go up to the folder with the engines in it, where we put the Stockfish 1.9 folder. Here I can right click and select paste and now the exe folder is in the in our, the exe file is in the folder that we want. Now remember we put it in program files, chess dvds, master chess 7000, engines and we made a folder called stockfish 1.9 and we put the exe file which is the engine inside of that folder. Now I return to master chess 7000. Now when I go to commands and change engine settings. I'll click on Add Engine. Inside the Engines folder, it shows Robolito, Ruffian, Stockfish, and our new Stockfish 1.9 folder. So I'll open that one. Inside there is the exe file that we left. I select that and click Open. It wants to know the engine's nickname, and for simplicity, I'll just call it Stockfish 1.9. You might want to put 32-bit or whatever else you want on there, but for simplicity, Stockfish 1.9.
Now we've given it a nickname, it automatically suggests a UCI startup command. And every engine I think needs one of those. And we'll click OK. That's it. We've just added a new engine and it's running. Stockfish 1.91 is running. That's how to add engines to Master Chess 7000.